because the tux is probably the most iconic uh, of the James Bond wardrobe looks. Um, Again, I revisited what each Bond had worn in the form of evening wear in all the films prior to this, and then specifically paid special attention to what Daniel had worn in terms of evening wear in the previous films he had done. So we knew we wouldn't, immediately we knew we wouldn't want to repeat something that was just done in the last film, and we wouldn't really necessarily want to repeat any of the other ones. I mean, as, as his fifth venture into this, I feel like one of the other responsibilities you have um, weight on your shoulders as a designer for Bond is that you need to do, you need to move him forward. Um, you need to sort of take the essence of what's come before and move it forward for the next iteration. I went through all the catalog of Bond villains because they've become iconic and they're parodied even. Um, and there's a sort of through line with all of them um, that uh, I definitely wanted to pay homage to. Lashana uh, Nomi in our film, um, again, I, I'm so lucky. Every, all the actors were so collaborative and Lashana's, I think we ended up having something like 27 fittings with her and you know, m more often than not, half of the fitting was just spent gabbing away about how we could approach the character and then the other half was the technical part of the fitting. Um, she, Lashana is so up f for like whatever you want to suggest. She's so willing to try things. She's so open. But she's also, having said that, she's also very, very secure and self-possessed and uh, very aware of what she doesn't want. Unlike Nomi, who I had just said can't really be running around in heels doing her tactical moves, Anna, on the other hand, as Paloma, does run around in heels doing her tactical moves. And I would argue that that is precisely because she is going in as a party guest. She can't be going into that event dressed in tactical gear. So the surprise of her being able to conduct all of this, all these crazy stunts in what seems like a diaphanous dress is like the strength of that costume and that character, I think.